Hi there. So in this video, we are going to see R Studio notebooks or simply R notebooks and how to use them. So if you are on R Studio, go to File, the new file, and then click on R notebook. Similarly, you can choose from this icon and select R notebook, and it will immediately create one template of notebook in front of you it will show you the title then output html notebook and also some by default text that it's added here okay so as you can see it has one chunk written here with markdown code so three hyphens then curly bracket r and ending it with again three hyphen and inside you'll find one code plot cast and on right hand side you'll find option to execute this chunk and modify chunk options okay so let's execute this and as you can see it will plot the cast data right here okay so you get the idea for distance and speed from the default cast data set. Okay, so this document basically is like Jupyter Notebook in Python, where you get to write your custom comments and then you can also execute the code within your notebook. Okay, so Let's say if I want to execute a simple code, such as summary of iris database, I will use three hyphen, then curly bracket R, then I will just use summary, then iris, and then three hyphen. Okay, now if I execute this code, it will show me the summary for iris three can go for iris as well and it will update that data okay so everything happens within this notebook now what if I want to export my these observations and the chunk in a HTML file or PDF in that case I just have to check preview notebook and I can export this to HTML PDF or Word so let's choose preview notebook I can choose to store this on desktop can click on preview and it will show me the current changes that I have made to this markdown document and it will display it in HTML format okay as you can see uh, it will look just like your typical Python notebook output okay now you can export this in PDF or word file if you are trying to document your work with the data sets that you are using for notebook okay so this was a simple introduction to how to use notebook in your R studio and how to get your code chunk to be executed and displaying output within notebook.